today, more and more trucks are equipped with air dryers that also have oil coalescing cartridges. And those are required to protect sensitive components like shifters on automated manual transmissions and emission controls and other automated functions on the truck. Yet, even though these are more popular than ever, there's a lot of confusion about how these cartridges work and the service requirements for them after they've been on the truck for a few years. So let's take a look inside of an air dryer cartridge. And specifically here is an oil coalescing cartridge, a Bendix Pure Guard version. To the left, you can see the base plate. That's the metal plate that actually screws onto an air dryer. And this base plate uses a 39 millimeter thread, which is very common for trucks in North America. In the center is the desiccant housing, and that serves a couple purposes. Number one, it contains the desiccant. The desiccant is what you see on the right-hand side. That desiccant is designed to remove moisture from the air system during the charge cycle and then release it so it's exhausted from the dryer during the purge cycle. In addition is an oil coalescing filter, and you can see the white filter media at the bottom of that cartridge housing, and that is a, a series of wraps of material, and that's designed to take small oil aerosols that pass from the compressor during the charge cycle and force them to form larger droplets. Once the droplets get large enough, gravity helps them to escape into the bottom of the cartridge where they can be exhausted during the purge cycle. Lastly, part of what makes Bendix Pure Guard unique is the addition of a check seal. That's what you see in front of the housing. That check seal allows the purge air to bypass the coalescing media so that we don't have any cross-contamination during the purge cycle. Let's take a look at what's inside the dryer cartridge and what happens to it after a few years of operation on a typical truck. These are from actual uh, fleets that we work with. And you can see here, the samples are from an air dryer cartridge that's been out working for about three years. So that's a significant amount of time for one of these spin-on cartridges. To the left, you can see the desiccant. The desiccant looks like brand new and it performs like brand new. And that's because the PureGuard oil coalescing cartridge has been removing the oil from the system and keeping it off the desiccant. In the center, you see a small amount of oil. That is effectively the amount of oil that gets passed into the service tanks during this period. It's a very small amount of oil compared to what is actually produced from the compressor. And then on the right, you can see the resultant uh, coalescing filter uh, after it's done its job here for several years. You can see that it's intact. Um, it's relatively clean. So this cartridge, after a couple years of service, was still performing like a brand new product. Now here we see the inside of a competitive cartridge after a similar amount of time on the road. And you can see here two examples of desiccant that have not done very well in the normal service interval. Uh, to the left and to the right, or actually in the center, are samples from similar trucks on the road about three years. The desiccant on the left is operating at about 50% of its new capacity. And you can see the bottle in the center, how dark that is. Uh, that is so fouled with oil that it does not actually remove moisture anymore. So that dryer was, is ineffective uh, on the truck. And uh, you can also see from testing the amount of oil that gets passed by this type of cartridge. And it's about uh, 20 times more than a PuraGuard. And that's, uh, that's a direct reflection of the design of the cartridge where the oil coalescing filter is placed after the desiccant and not before. And so, of course, that desiccant gets contaminated with oil before the uh, filter can actually do its job. So you can see here for these two types of cartridges, very different effects, even though they're both classified oil coalescing, you can see the Bendix PureGuard cartridge is much more effective. So the two most common questions we're asked about the PureGuard cartridge are first, how often does it need to be replaced? And second, where does it need to be used? So the first question is typically the recommended service interval for most applications is approximately two years, uh, 250,000 miles. Uh, obviously, depending on the level of duty, if it's severe vocational, it might be every year, or it could be a little more. In some long hauls, it could actually be greater than two years. And then where to use a Bendix Pure Guard cartridge? Well, if the truck was equipped with an oil coalescing cartridge, it's required to replace it with another oil coalescing cartridge. So um, very often we see as trucks get older, uh, 
fleets decide they might want to try to save some money by buying a standard cartridge, but you can subject your equipment to some pretty serious uh, repair cost. So a pure guard cartridge can be used in any application that has a standard cartridge or oil coalescing, and, uh, but you can never change from oil coalescing back to standard. Bendix, pure guard, oil coalescing air dryer cartridges are designed for any truck that requires a higher quality air supply and longer reliability.